Well, good Tuesday, everybody. I'm Jason Laird with the Montana Egg Network. Here's a look at your storm tracker weather forecast. Another cold day all across central Montana, especially along the high line today. Wanted to start talking about snowpack. Uh, we're looking pretty decent for the year already. You notice we're looking at decent accumulations throughout many of the mountain ranges, and even a little light dusting along the high line there uh, in the cut bank and Haver, but kind of breaking down a few of those percentages. Here's how things play out for us. Even a few areas closer to Bozeman and seeing about 126%. Now again, we're looking at the snow water equivalent percentage of normal. All right, so uh, here closer to home, about 55%, 105 into a few of the mountain ranges a little bit further to our west. Over the next few days, here's how things are going to play out. We're still looking at that big trough, and that's created a big dip in the jet stream, allowed for that cold air to settle in. So we're still looking at cold temperatures tomorrow on Wednesday, but that system is going to start tracking out. A little bit windy on Wednesday as well. By Thursday morning, we're going to start to see a high pressure ridge move in. That's going to shove that cold air mass out of the way and allow for more sunny conditions once Thursday afternoon into Friday rolls around. So the next six to 10 days, we are looking a little bit drier throughout eastern Montana, maybe a little bit wetter throughout western Montana. Temperature wise, a little bit warmer in the northeastern corner of the state, all thanks to that area of high pressure that's going to be building in. So looking at some decent snowpack out there, cold but warming up.